much. And less than a week after a car crash killed four girls, parents in White County are fighting to put up signs in hopes of preventing any more accidents. KRK Force Ken Buffa shows us what they're doing to make the area where they died a little bit safer. Ken, what are they doing? Well, Shannon and Bob, these parents say too many wrecks have happened on this road and some kind of warning is in desperate need. Bull Hill Road in White County is a scenic route lined with a lake, Man, leaves, and trees. Wednesday afternoon, tears, agony, and frustration have changed the scenery. This guardrail is literally a launch pad. Karen Garriott is looking to change the scene some more, starting with this guardrail lining the nearby bridge. It literally launches a car into that tree. The mother of five says the guardrail at the bottom of the downhill turn vanishes in the fog. Proof she says she has in photos when her son crashed on a foggy night years ago. Proof these mourners say they have in flowers and memories of the four Cabot girls who died after hitting the rail Halloween night. I think it should be immediately put up because there are so many kids that go back and forth on this road. I called the street department to ask if there were signs about this bend. He told me yes, but standing here and looking behind me, I think the answer is no. There's no signs. Not only that, there's no reflectors. There needs to be a taller guardrail. There needs to be some posts or something. As this mother fights for a sign. I feel almost like it's partly my fault because I didn't do anything when it happened to my son. These kids are putting up signs of their own. I'm Cody Rice okay. since I was eight years old. In hopes the scenery here will change once again. This is the second time it's happened. How many more kids have to die or people have to die? Gary has started a Facebook group and moments ago, State Senator Eddie Joe Williams joined it and told her he is working for the change. Friends of the victims in the wreck say that road is used heavily by students heading to the ASU BB campus. Bob Ash, Shannon, back to you.